हाय फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू अनदर इंफॉर्मेटिक वीडियो बेस्ड ऑन द इलेक्ट्रिकल इक्विपमेंट्स सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न द कंप्लीट इंफॉर्मेशन रिगार्डिंग अ सर्किट ब्रेकर एंड अ रिले सो व्हाट इज अ सर्किट ब्रेकर एंड व्हाट इज अ रिले वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्टिंग बिटवीन दीज टू थिंग दैट मीन्स वट इज अ सर्किट ब्रेकर एंड वट आर द डिफरेंसेस बिटवीन द सर्किट ब्रेकर एंड द रिले इन अ वेरी प्रॉपर मैनर प्लीज वॉच टिल द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो बिकॉज दिस वीडियो इज गोइंग टू बी वेरी इंफॉर्मेटिव एंड वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग ऑल्सो फॉर यू गाइज सो लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो विदाउट टेकिंग मस्ट टाइम सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट सी वट इज अ सर्किट ब्रेकर सो सर्किट ब्रेकर इज एन इलेक्ट्रिकल सेफ्टी डिवाइस विच इज डिजाइन टू प्रोटेक्ट एन इलेक्ट्रिकल सर्किट फ्रॉम डैमेज कॉज बाय ओवर करेंट so the basic function of a circuit breaker is to interrupt the current flow to protect the equipment and to prevent the risk of fire in the industries okay so basically the circuit breakers are used in the industries and also in our home also the circuit breaker used because it is generally used to protect the over current or the fire to the home or to the circuit so a circuit breaker is generally used to protect the system from over current or to protect the risk of fire in the home or in the industries so this is the use of the circuit breaker and circuit breaker trips shut off when flow of protective relay detect a fault okay whenever the fault is detected by the relay then suddenly the circuit breaker trip or shut off the plug or the switch okay so the fault may be due to ground fault or from short circuit fault okay so here you can see the symbol for the circuit breaker so the examples of circuit breakers are mcb that is very popular circuit breaker which is used in the industries as well as in our home we are using the mcb and the second one that is rccb this is also another important circuit breaker okay so then elcb and then acb then vcb and etc these all are the examples of a circuit breaker okay so these circuit breakers are very popular circuit breaker because these are very frequently and very useful thing in the industries and also in our homes okay so now let's talk about what is a relay so relays are electrically operated switches that open and also close the circuits by receiving the electrical signals from outside sources okay so whenever it feels like it senses some sudden change in the current in the system will available then it will open or close the circuit after receiving the signal from the sources okay so this is generally used as a sensing part of a electrical circuit okay so relay works as a sensing device okay because it senses the over current in the system so that's why it is known as a sensing part or sensing device in the electrical system and it is an electromagnetic switch operated by a relatively small electric current that can turn on or turn off a much larger electric current okay because it open or close the circuit after sensing the electric current that is over current in the system so that's why it is known as the sensing device in the electrical system so the heart of relay is known as the electromagnet why the heart of relay is known as the electromagnet because it function like the heart for the relay why because the electromagnet is a coil of wire that becomes a temporary magnet whenever the electricity or the electric current flows through it so whenever we make flow the current in the coil of wire that will become a temporary magnet okay so that's why it is known as a electromagnet without electricity we cannot make it as a magnet so that's why we are making it as a mag it as a electromagnet from the coil of wire okay so whenever the current is flowing through that coil that is becoming the electromagnet so that's why it's known as a heart for the relay okay
so now let's talk about where the relay is actually used okay so relays are normally used in the control panels and also in the manufacturing and the building automations to control the power along with settings the smaller current values in the control circuit okay so it senses the small current value or the fault in the system so that's why we're using in the many cases that is a control panel in the system or in the uh, automation system and also manufacturing the building also we are using the relays okay so the in this category we are generally using the relays okay so the example so now let's talk about what are the examples or the main popular relays which are very popularly used in the industries and in our day to day life what are those so those relays are generally emr that is electromechanical relays and the second one that is the distance relays and the third one that is the solid state relays that is ssr relays and the last one that is a read relays and also there are many kind of relays are available in the market so these are the main popular relays which are very popularly used in the industries in and in our day to day life or in our homes okay so this is all about the basic concept about the circuit breaker and the relays so see you in the next video thanks for watching this video